Hello everybody, Terry Ronzio here with another episode of Vanishing America. Today I'm going to, we're, we're actually going to talk about a town that existed a hundred years ago here. Exactly right where I am. And it was called the town of Whipkey. And a lot of you know, I've been walking, this is a portion of the uh, Whipkey Ridge Warpath that I've walked many many times I do t uh, legs of 10 miles up here on the Whipkey Ridge but as you know I reached 10,000 miles and I'm taking a break from walking for the troops right now but I will keep walking with the flag to wake people up about the truth about what's going on but anyways the town of Whipkey like I said existed here and this is a fracking well right here okay and it, out, out that road right there is a fracking well now I want to show you guys so anyways, they started fracking for gas here, and the reason why there used to be a town called Whipkey Ridge, Whipkey, the town of Whipkey, because uh, there was oil here. This was one of the first areas in the world that had oil wells, and the result of that, a, a town sprung up out of, not, out of nowhere, out of the Pennsylvania Outback, and the town of Whitby was born. Well now, I know this is going to be a lot of uh, news to you, uh, but the, the earth regenerates oil. So they started fracking here for gas, and now they're fracking for oil, because the oil that used to be here in this area has regenerated now this fracking, this whole little hole here, three weeks ago, was a major fracking for oil operation. Now, they sealed it, they got what they had to get out of there. They're like little termites in the world. Now see right over there? They, that's another oil well. So they're fracking for oil here in West Green. And uh, no, don't be excited. Vanishing America is still Vanishing America. Because like the old days, a town would have generated up in the area and it was good for the, uh, the national economy but not anymore because the new world order has basically this like I like my blog I always put on these uh, Spanish American uh, Spanish America uh, videos I always put a, a link to a blog I did with fracking for gas, who needs armies to take over the world? So that's Agenda 21. That's what you know. That's what these videos are all about. Agenda 21, Vanishing America. Uh, how they're basically using the fracking industry and the coal mine industry to gobble up farmland, towns, and uh, there goes a the deer. There's a whole bunch of deer. Hey guys. See, I couldn't do this when I was walking. Well, I did when I was walking and I was quiet, but I was always, when I'd be talking to you guys, when I was walking with the flag, I could never jump some deer like that. So there to go around here. But anyways, yeah, um, so that's a well, like I said, fracking for oil there. There's a fracking for gas well over that hill there. Uh, this is just like becoming the uh, Saudi Arabia, like, like I told you guys. And they're moving people out. Uh, they don't take care of this road very much anymore, and I told my mom strategically they're they're not really taking care of these roads like they used to because they don't want people to live here anymore. And uh, basically, these guys that do the oil wells and everything, you know, you guys see ice road truckers, right? They they can work better on these roads when they're frozen over and everything. So. They don't care about the people, it's always about, and like I said, but where's, where, where's the money? Why hasn't the gas prices gone down? What's going on? Uh, you know what I mean? Like, we, sh we should be, uh, the gas prices at the pump should be coming down because, like I said, I told I just report to you guys for the check it out yourselves. I know I'm right. The, the, the world regenerates um, oil, so... Basically, if you think about it, what the fuck? Now, like I told, I just did a video uh, when I left my job here because more deer. Well, uh, 
that might be probably the same deer and now they're like what the hell is this guy doing but anyways um like i, I was reporting doing the camp trail report um now i forget what i was gonna say the deer well anyways but anyways i just wanted to let you guys know this used to be the town of whipkey and like i said you guys have known it was the whipkey ridge warpath because i walked up here all the time with the flag uh 10 segment this is like a segment of the 10 miles that i did uh every time i walked up here but uh i'm gonna like i said i'm gonna start walking with the flag again I, uh, my goal is to uh, walk in every all 50 states, so uh, never fear. Uh, and I'm walking on sad on a sad note. I'm walking three miles. It's a, it's an it's a honorable no uh, note, but it's still sad because we all know that this war is a big fucking scam, just like everything else. Everything's a lie, and I walk the truth. So. You know, when I started walking for the troops all those years ago, it'll be eight years in August, but um, I've been on a like a four month, four to five month break right now since August. Um, I, yeah, I reached 10,000 miles in seven years, but uh, I, I need the troops to know the truth about everything because they say, oh, here's this guy. He's done all this hard work for us. Uh, it doesn't stop there, guys. Uh, I just have... I'm a very knowledgeable man, and uh, I've been strategically being attacked. Like I was—that's what I wanted to let you guys know. I've been strategically uh, I'm be being attacked by the New World Order. They're giving, making it really hard for me to get these videos out to you guys. I can't even comment on my YouTube videos, so it's up to you guys uh, to pass my videos around because I can't do the legwork anymore because they have strategically. Uh, uh, at least I can get these videos uploaded for you guys. So I'm going to keep, I, I go to, I can't, well, it's a long story. Go back to that video I did on uh, the chemtrails and find out the update on what they've been doing to me to try to stop me from getting these videos out to you. But um, yeah, the world regenerates oil. Look it up. Yeah, we've been fucking... Uh, it's the end. They cannot do this to us anymore. Like I told you guys in that chemtrail video, we have to go to the town hall meetings in your towns and tell those motherfuckers, yes, it, we voted you to be our, we need help. We need you guys to talk to the people in the state. And the people in the state are going to say, well, this isn't a state matter. Fuck you. It's time, these people we elected, it's time to put their fucking balls and ass to the fire because I'm telling you, my friends, freedom of speech is really hard right now. The, uh, in, the, in that video I just did, with, I, just, I reported, uh, go back to that video and check it out. Um, but they're definitely, the freedom of speech on the internet is coming to a big screeching halt fast. So take this info war to the streets, wake them up, they're poisoning, the, they, they put these frack, this is the headwaters to a whole bunch of streams. Like I said in the last fracking video, uh, the, the, all these, all this water flows into the Ohio River and that's why West Virginia their water is poisoned by this fracking because it's not because of a sudden sp it's because all this fracking water all this groundwater all this poison is going into the Ohio River and and it's totally toxic and I know uh, that they all oh, know that's wrong Terry uh, no it's right because I've been telling you guys uh, the fracking is destroying the groundwater uh, and we have to we have to take the bull by the horns and take control of this situation my friends because humanity is in great peril right now if we do not do something if you guys live a lie and like pretend oh this guy's crazy uh, this, he, he doesn't know what he's talking about yeah if you guys don't do anything it's gonna be over humanity as we know it will be over all right i'll see you guys in the next video have a great day wherever you're at in the world.